Good evening, everybody. It is, let's see what time it is. It is 12 01. So it is Wednesday, May 3rd. Okay, this is part four of Kathy Glasses Neglected. As we walked, or as we talked about Jamie, I asked Shannon if he was allergic to anything or taking any medication. She said as far as they knew, he wasn't. She completed the paperwork that allowed me to foster Jamie and then said she'd have a look around the house before they went. It's usual for the child social worker to check the foster care's home when they place a child and also at most subsequent visits. I'll phone you with the time of contact tomorrow, she added. It'll be at the family center. You know where that is? Yes. Would you like to see the house too? I asked Jamie as Shannon and Nathan stood. He kept his eyes closed and the rag in his mouth and shook his head. So I stayed with him in the living room while the social workers looked around the house. It's going to be all right, love. I told Jamie quietly as I cuddled him. His eyes remained tightly shut. I heard the social workers go upstairs in and out of the bedrooms and the bathroom, then come down again. They reappeared in the living room. There is just you and your daughter living here? Shannon asked. Yes, I've been divorced for many years, she nodded. Which bedroom will Jamie be in? The one next to mine, I replied. There is a single bed already made up, or do you want him to use a cot? Jamie is used to a cot, Nathan said. Too, too much so, Shannon commented. He was left in it day and night. He might be better in a bed. I'll try him in the bed and see how it goes, I asked. I said, won't he fall out of it? If won't he fall out if he's not used to it? Nathan asked. That's all for part four. Kathy Glasses neglected. Thank you for watching.